commitment to innovation and a higher level of education, Palm Beach State College's cybersecurity programs enhances the student experience by developing the first educational cybersecurity lab in Palm Beach County and South Florida. As part of America's $2 billion initiative to expand targeted training programs in local communities, the XLIT program funded by the Trade Adjustment Assistance Community College and Career Training Grant provides opportunities for veterans, unemployed and underemployed to gain the competitive skills needed to succeed in today's in-demand jobs in the information technology, healthcare, energy, and advanced manufacturing industry sectors. Our programs have been enhanced um, by the TAC grant by it's allowing us to really fund some of the, the cool things that we'd like to accomplish, um, mainly getting some uh, really high-end equipment that will allow us to simulate uh, real-world attacks, uh, give students hands-on uh, ability to really test hardware, software, um, you know, different types of network uh, configurations. And uh, it's also allowed us to, to revise our curriculum to tie it to some of the industry certifications that are out there. Job placement is something that we are taking seriously. That's why we built this uh, cybersecurity lab with the, with the breaking point device. So they can actually do what the industry is already doing. Um, so I think that, that would be the greatest benefit. The cybersecurity lab provides an opportunity for students to observe threats see how it affects the computer. They will also be able to run the threat. The advantage of the cybersecurity lab, we have a special piece of equipment that gives students the ability to simulate thousands of computers at one time and see how it affects the system. Well, people do ask the question, why cybersecurity? And I'm, I'm rather surprised that they even ask the question. We're surrounded daily with intrusions on a large magnitude in companies and I think personally, a lot of us have had some issues with somebody hacking into something that we hold dear in, on our cell phone or in another venue. I was excited when I first came to the college because the cybersecurity concentration was one of the concentrations that was developed in our program already. And what better than to develop and refine curriculum and give students hands-on activity opportunities in a lab so that when they go into the job market, they're going to be the most competitive candidates out there. So I hope to see us leading the way for cybersecurity training of the future and to help not only our students, but the businesses that we work with and that our innovation will be recognized for all the good work that it's done. So the role of the cybersecurity specialist in the future is going to be one of a, being a business advisor that's involved in more than just the user IDs and password administration that we see in businesses today. They'll be thinking about ways of providing advice and counsel to management so that security is a part of the thought process, part of the planning process, so that we begin to look at how security will impact the user groups and stakeholders in an enterprise, like their customers, their employers, their business partners. The cybersecurity person will have to have deep knowledge of not just the hardware, but the software, methods, policies, and practices necessary to secure an enterprise. I'm so incredibly jazzed and happy that we have the Cyber Lab up and running. Well, the Cyber Lab is going to be an awesome experience. One of the shortcomings of working in the uh, field of security is that you don't really get to play. Uh, when you're working with real systems, you really break things if you start you know, fiddling with things and, and, and messing with things in real life. So that one of the main things we wanted to do there, which I think is in the works, is to uh, imitate cyber attacks, which is something that, you know, you rarely ever get to do. We read about it, but you rarely ever get to do hands-on, you know, uh, play, you know, the attacker or, or the defender. So that is going to be a really good experience for everyone involved.